and how much the work is being put into say Zimbabwe beginning to see themselves as trying to be one of the big boys and not say okay we're trying to play second fiddle to the West Indies. Well I think you can see over the last year or so you know how much our game has changed. Our players are a lot fitter now especially after the six week training camp we did and I think we're broaching the whole professionalism of uh, sportsmen a lot better now than we have done in the past so guys are, are focused on their fitness, they're, they're focused on their, uh, on their games, their skills but I think also there's been a big focus on their lifestyles and what they do away from the ground and away from the team to keep themselves in the best condition they can be to play. And one player who a lot of people were looking at before the series, Tendai Shatara, he's just shown that he's still got a lot of quality, doesn't he? He has. I mean, he, you know, on his day, everyone sort of thinks, because he's been around a long time, Chats. You know, I think he played when he was about 16 or 17, so everyone thinks he's late 30s. He's only 31, and he's got a lot of good cricket to play for us. Um, but if he gets himself into the condition physically that he's in now, we've seen what a difference that makes to his game. And also your other frontline bowlers, Mzarabani, Brad Evans, also getting wickets? Absolutely. So we've bowled well. Our seamers in particular have bowled well. We haven't even seen Richie Ngarava. He hasn't played as yet. I'm hoping to get him in, involved in one, if not two, of the next games. Um, but I think we've got a good attack going, you know, going well at the moment. And we, we know that whichever side we put out, we carry four or five spinners with us. So it's important that our seamers are in good form. And at the moment, they look uh, quite special. The captaincy of Wellington Masakadza, what are your thoughts on that? Yeah, well, it's always nice to give uh, new captains a go. You know, Sean's not going to go on forever. And we've got to look to replacing them. I think, as well as teaching skills, batting, bowling, and everything, we need to educate captains. So you know, Wellington is one of a line of uh, you know a number of guys who could uh, quite easily take over the captaincy from Craig at some stage. Um, you know, so I think he's done a particularly good job in these four games. Yeah. Um, what, what say you what, to the fans that should be coming? Oh, out? it'd be great to see them in. Get, you know, practice getting their voice in. You know, so they can have a dress rehearsal for their support for us, just like we're having for the cricket. Uh, it would be great to see them. Um, you know, those that have been here already have made a bit of noise and there weren't many, but uh, we had quite a few on Sunday. Uh, it would be nice to see the place buzzing again.